Yeah. Gorgeous. Yeah. We had a little taste of spring, like mm -hmm. periodically throughout late winter, but now we are going to have a little bit more of that standing power when it comes to those warmer temperatures. And right now, as we approach midnight, 55 degrees. Wow, that's a mild start. But folks, we're tracking our next inbound warm front, and that's going to set the stage for absolutely mild and just spectacular afternoon for your Monday. But the clouds could spoil a few things if you're looking forward to that corona really uh, setting up across uh, the skyline there uh, when the uh, moon is going to be in full view. 55 degrees, clouds are going to be building, and temperatures right now are ranging between the upper 40s and lower 50s right now. But off to the west, here's our next batch of rain that's on its way that's already crossing over state lines and it should be arriving here as we head beyond midnight tonight but a bit of a dry layer right at the surface but eventually it's going to saturate and give us scattered chances of rain for tonight right into early Monday morning. Speaking of which, this is your eclipse forecast, folks. We have rain included with your big picture forecast. This is 3 a.m. Rain will be arriving while many of us will be sleeping. By the time we're waking up, it will be a cloudy start. But off to the west, we are already starting to see peaks of sunny skies, and that's going to be trending for us as we approach midday for Monday. You can see the overall trend here. We're going to have a breakage of the cloud coverage and it's clearing further off to the uh, to the west, but a uh, high level clouds and also those series level clouds could be a part of the forecast as well. But overall, as we approach totality around 315 again, folks, we're looking at three minutes and 49 seconds. That's all we need to have a good viewing of the totality as the moon gets in view around 315. And right now, the clouds are appearing to be thicker the further east you are compared to the further west you are. But a level of high level clouds are still in the mix as, the, uh, as we get closer to tomorrow afternoon, especially approaching 3 and 4 o'clock. So here's a more visual view of what to expect as we uh, approach 315 as the sun uh, uh, begins uh, blocked by the moon here around 315. We're going with mostly uh, partly cloudy skies, then mostly clear as we uh, conclude the afternoon into the early evening. So overall, folks, it going throughout time here with your National Design Mark forecast is going to be mild and it's going to be sunny, but clouds are going to be in a mix more high level cloud coverage approaching two and three o'clock then just tracking clear skies as we approach this eve tomorrow evening with temperatures in the upper 60s rain chances they're going to be likely all week long so make sure you have the rain gear ready to go here's your 10-day union home Mortgage forecast, 70s on the way for Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, rain chances. They're going to be increasing by late Wednesday and early Thursday. Thursday right now seems to be a complete washout where rains and rumble, some thunderstorms in the mix. That's going to set us up for a slightly cooler wrap up to your work week, mid 50s, then a nice rebound into the lower 60s by next weekend. Some more of that staying power. Well, I was trying to stay with those like mild that. temperatures. Been looking for that. That's on the way. Okay, we just need that three minute window. That's all we need. <laughs> it looks, looks, looks likely. It looks okay, good. Sounds good. Thanks, Anthony. Sure.